What is up YouTube? This is Rizvi here and welcome back to my channel. I'm back with another tutorial for you guys. Today I'll show you how to make a powerful, funky and cool comic effect in your photo like this one with the help of Photoshop. This process will take less than 5 minutes but it's quite effective. So watch it carefully and leave a like if you think the video was cool. Let's jump into the tutorial. I've already selected my photo here. Please make sure your photo's resolution is good, otherwise the result won't be that good. To check the resolution of your photo, go to image, image size and check it. Choose a photo with a resolution with 150 or above. At first, crop the unnecessary portion of the image out. Select the crop tool and crop it like this to focus the subject. Then press this tick button over here. After cropping it, we're going to add some highlight to the photo. Go to image then adjustments and then select shadows and highlights. I'm putting 15 for both the values. You can play with the numbers if you like. Now, make a copy of this layer and rename it line. Now, make this layer invisible by clicking here. After that, activate the first layer and make it a smart object. When a layer is converted into a smart object, any effect applied to the layer can be separated easily. Now, we're going to add three effects to the main layer. Go to Filter, Filter Gallery and from the Artistic folder, choose Poster Edges Effect. Make the thickness 0, Edge Intensity 4 and Posterization 1. You can change the numbers to your liking as well if you're not happy with the results. Press OK when you're done. Now, double click on the filter icon here and make the opacity 75%. This will decrease the hardness of the effect a little. Now, again go to the filter gallery and this time choose the cutout effect from the artistic folder. Make the number of levels 6, edge simplicity 4 and edge fidelity 2. Press OK when you're done. After applying the effect, again double click on the filter icon and make its opacity 70%. You'll notice the comic effect is starting to be visible in your photo. Again go to filter and this time go to pixelate and choose color half tone. Put maximum radius 4. Then put 45 in all the four channels and press OK. This will give you a dot effect. Double click on the filter icon and decrease its opacity to 75% and change its blend mode to soft light. The color half tone effect will look cleaner and less blurry now. We're almost done with the editing. Now make the line layer visible and active. Then go to filter gallery and choose glowing edges from the stylize folder. Make the width 1, brightness 3 and smoothness 15. Press OK and don't get nervous. Now again and for the last time go to the filter gallery and from the sketch effect, choose torn edges effect. Make the image balance 4, smoothness 15 and contrast 12. This will create lines over the glowing edges of the previous effect. Press OK. Make this layer's blend overlay and decrease its opacity to 40%. This will make the lines of the object more clear. You can ignore this process if you want. We're done with the comic effect. But for further editing, I'm going to add a frame on this photo. I'll give you the link of this frame in the description box. Place it over the photo and adjust it. Change its opacity if you want to. There you go. 
a cool and funky comic effect on your photo. Please subscribe if you enjoyed my video and leave a like. Till my next video, stay healthy. Peace out.